All right, my last review of the day. Um, Nir Nirvana, never mind, deluxe edition. It's got, um, of course, you know, never mind is one of the greatest albums of all time by Nirvana. Um, apparently, you know, this is right after he pretty much did in utero and and unplugged. It was basically a great time for him, but alone, lo and behold, he had some great inner demons and in most of his music that he wrote. Um, the, the, basically, some of the stuff that he wrote on there was Smells Like a Teen Spirit, which really rang out to me as a kid, and also um, Still Today is one of my favorite songs that he has always done. Um, he also got Lithium on there, which is a really great song. Um, the guitar playing is outrageously awesome. Um, I, I don't know what else to say. The Just, you know, the whole Kurt Kogut pain thing was just pretty off the chain. That's all I gotta say. Um, it is also got some uh, rare studio tracks on it as well um, that I can say, along with Bleach, if both albums, if you get a ch chance to check that out. Also, um, I'm sorry I'm talking about this, but I uh, feel like I'm talking to a machine, but that's all right. Um, both Nirvana Bleach, Nevermind, and also In Utero are now deluxe editions. So basically, they got more studio tracks on them, and basically, it makes it seem like he's a real guitar, good guitar player. Um, I will ever for miss, miss Kurt Cobain because of his great guitar playing and his great lyric writing. Um, from like an, off of Insensicide and uh, Bleach, um, along with Nevermind, the guitar playing got more technical and more heavier. Um, as we go by. Even one of the songs um, from In Utero is actually featured um, from the Beavis and Butthead soundtrack, which we all know is I Hate Myself and I Want to Die. That's one of the songs that was on that, even though I don't recommend you do that. Um, sincerely, that is not one, th one of the things that I'm also about. I'm also about, um, if you get this message also, th this message also goes out to people here down in Anchorage and all over the world, especially for the little kids. I'm also against, uh, I do like guns, don't get me wrong, but the problem is, is people are now carrying guns and knives around here and it's just, get, it's driving me nuts, man, and it's just getting out of control. Um, if you can understand my, my, um, my opinion, you know, it's just, the violence is just getting to be too much in this day and age and we all could do a lot better to, uh, in this society that we live in. Um, I also believe that, you know, we can change the world and stop the violence, you know, and stop picking on people, you know, I've been a target of that. Music's always been a great communicator with me, and I always have to tell you that. Um, but, uh, you know, I've been lo loving music ever since I was about five or maybe even four years old, I just loved it, and so you know it's always been in my heart. So this is one of my favorites. Um, actually, these are three of my favorites. Plus, uh, and Synthesize, I liked both of these. Um, they just all four ring out really great. So five stars in all these, and also the last one, the box set is pretty rad too. And if you get the best of the box, I recommend that one too. So here we go, Nirvana. This is uh, the Nirvana. Uh, uh, never mind, review. Here, bye.